To get started, you're going to need paper, dowels, marbles, cutters, a metallic surface, local glue, hot glue, and glue sticks. A lot of glue sticks. Now this tutorial is going to be split into three parts. The first two parts are dedicated to building the ball part of the joint itself, because there are two methods of making it. One is for bigger ball joints and one for smaller ones. And the third part will be for the socket of the ball joint. To begin the first method, start by taking a thin dowel or stick and start putting small amounts of hot glue on one end. Wait for it to dry and continue adding more until you get close to the desired size. Mess around with that mass of hot glue by using the tip of the hot glue gun to shape it or by adding more hot glue in small amounts. Once dry and as close to the shape of a ball as possible, tear up small pieces of paper and cover the hot glue ball. Use the nozzle of the hot glue gun to attach the paper to the ball by heating up the ball mass over the pieces of paper. The ball of hot glue should then stick to the pieces of paper from inside. For the second method, start by tearing up a small piece of paper and wrap it around the marble of your desired choice. Twist it to make it look like a piece of candy and cut off the excess twist handles. Next, cut out two tiny pieces of paper and glue them paper to paper to cover the holes on the paper covering the marble. After drying, pour a small amount of glue over the marble and roll between both palms, then leave it to dry. Cut the paper sphere in half to take the marble out. Fill each half sphere with hot glue and place it on a flexible metallic surface. Pry it off when the hot glue hardens and dries. You should also get rid of any excess hot glue around the half spheres. Glue both halves together and get rid of any excess hot glue. Puncture a hole through the newly formed ball and heat up the hot glue inside using the nozzle of the glue gun. Cut two slits on your dowel, then put a bit of hot glue inside the hole, and then insert your dowel inside and leave it to dry. Now after making the ball parts, we can make the socket. First, create a ring of hot glue around the ball and leave it to dry. Take off the ring once dry. Next. Put the ring around the ball joint again. Cover one half of the ball shape with hot glue and leave it to dry. Take it off once again when it's dry and hardened. Now put the separated piece back on the ball and start hot gluing around the ball shape in a ring pattern till three-fourths of the ball is covered. Leave it to dry and take it off once done. Now you can pop the ball into the socket to test the friction and mobility of your ball joint. You can adjust if necessary by adding some hot glue or melting or cutting some away. Congratulations! You finished the ball joint. You can now build upon it and use it for heads or limbs of figures or other parts you need it for. I first designed this all the way back in 2018, though back then the ball part was just the marble itself which easily detached from its base. I managed to improve it since then, so I hope you all enjoyed this video and I'll do my best to be less lazy and make more figure videos in the future.